Hello and welcome to this presentation of Excel to Sage. My name is Aura Martirosian. I'm going to show you how easy it is to create or update supplier records in Sage 50 using Excel to Sage with just one click. So how could you use this import? Well, you can use it to create new suppliers that have been set up or created in other systems such as your website or your purchasing system. You can also use it to update existing supplier records, for example, changing the postcode. So let's see how easy it is to do that. So here's my Sage 50. As you can see, I don't have any supplier set up currently. What I want to do is import two suppliers called Red IT3 and Red IT4 per this Excel worksheet. As you can see, it has all the normal details. Furthermore, it also has the ability to have lookups. So, for example, the nominal code is looking up the list that can be manually defined. So all I have to do is go back into Sage and launch the application Excel to Sage. And here it is. I then click to connect to Sage. And as you can see, all of these particular functions have now become active. And what I'm going to do is click on suppliers, which will then go and create the new suppliers from the Excel spreadsheet into Sage. You can see it's now finished doing that. If I go into here and refresh the screen, you can now see that I have red IT3 and red IT4. But I can see that the phone and fax numbers are incorrect. So what I might want to do is refresh that. And that's very easy. I'll just go into my Excel workbook, go into the relevant cell, and change that to 111-22-333-44. I'll just save that Excel workbook. Having saved it, I'll then go back into my Excel to Sage and click on Supplies again. And this time, it will overwrite existing records. It's now finished doing that. So I'll now disconnect and exit from that. Go back into my Sage system, refresh the columns, and there we are. The telephone and the fax numbers have now been updated. So in summary, Excel to Sage is very easy to use. It's very quick and cost effective. And you can create the Excel file anywhere. It doesn't have to be on the machine that has Sage on it. It can then be emailed to your accountant who can then import it from the machine that has Sage installed on. It has user-defined validation lists, which will then uh, make sure that the data that uh, is going to be imported is correct and accurate. Thank you for your attention and I hope you found that presentation of interest. Please feel free to download our free trial now and uh, test it for yourself. You'll be glad that you did. Thank you.